Hi, I'm Professor Bluckerman, and these are your MS Financial Engineering Capstone Options. You have four different ways to complete your Master of Science degree in Financial Engineering here at NYU Poly. By New York State law, okay, you have to have a capstone for every single Master of Science program in the state of New York. We are no exception. So we provide four approaches to achieving this goal. First, a thesis. If you want to have a master's thesis, you want to do research. Master's thesis is a path that's chosen by students whose ultimate goal is to go on to do research in a doctoral program. To complete the thesis, you need to write a thesis. And to do that, you need a faculty advisor as soon as possible. A thesis is never a one semester effort. Do not try to begin a master's thesis in your last semester of study. The second option is an internship. There are lots and lots of internships out there in New York City for our students in financial engineering. And any internship that achieves 200 hours or more of work in our field is something that we're willing to consider for a capstone internship, three credits. At the end of that, you have to write a report. The report has to say the projects that you worked on, what your role was in each of those projects, and what you learned. The idea being that an internship is an educational experience, and we need to see that you've been educated by having this internship. Your third option is a master's project. To complete a master's project, again, you will need a faculty advisor. A project differs from a thesis in that a thesis is research related and a project is practical. There's lots and lots of practical applications for financial engineering out there waiting to be developed. And if you want to do one of them, if this excites you, and if you find a faculty advisor who is equally happy and excited by the idea of doing this work, a master's project, capstone project, is probably the best path for you. And finally, students can take two special topics courses. These are courses that we list with the word topics in the title of the course, T topics or TPCS as the registrar sometimes abbreviates it. Total of three credits, two 1.5 credit courses. And at the end of taking those two topics courses, to make that into a capstone, you need to write a capstone paper. Now this is a short report that covers the material that you learned in the two courses and how you would integrate it into the career that you intend to have uh, in order to make you a much better professional financial engineer. Any questions, please don't hesitate to give me a call, stop by, or send me an email.